What's going on, people? Mr. Ellis here, Glass City Cichlids. I know some of you that was watching my earlier videos may remember this 10 gallon tank. This was going to be my 10 gallon dirty tank. Well, well, setting that up, I got sidetracked and got to messing with my 75 gallon tank and messing with my African cichlids. And to make a long story short, man, the water, I don't know, the water was brown and I had to do way too many water changes and it still wasn't coming clear. And I really don't think I want to do dirt. But <clears throat> the reason for making this video is because now I do know the direction I want to take this tank in and I'm, I'm certain of the direction I want to take this tank in and now that my African cichlid tank is pretty much done. I can get started with this one and what I want to do with this one is I want to put freshwater shrimp in here not sure to breed yet because my local fish store gets them and sell them so quick right now they have some shrimp called ninja shrimp really interested in them hopefully I can get some of those <coughs> excuse me but uh yeah so I am going to put plants in here because it's going to be a shrimp tank so I got to plant it and I'm going to have java moss and I'm not sure on the other plants yet and that is the reason for me making this video is because now I need your guys ideas I don't know anything about freshwater shrimp so I need to know everything from the bottom up starting from the substrate which substrate should I use to the plants uh, what, what would be good what would be some good plants in a low tech tank because this this light I don't even know the wattage of the light. I can't find it nowhere. Really don't care. I just want some low-tech tanks. I don't want <clears throat> anything that's too advanced for me because, like I said, I don't know anything about this part of the hobby yet. I'm just getting started. So if you guys can help me out with that. Uh, my wife's on the way to the store to pick me up a sponge filter. I know for a fact I'm going to need a sponge filter for the shrimp. But I don't know what type of substrate I should use. I have sand and I have gravel. So uh, whichever one y'all tell me to use, that's what I'll be using. <clears throat> uh, what else? Uh, water conditions. Uh, with the pH coming out of my tap water right now is 7.6, I believe. I can't remember. It's either 7.6 or 7.8. I had to check. But uh, if y'all could let me know some good water conditions and yeah, any advice, I would. Uh, yeah, I appreciate it. I would appreciate any advice you could give. And this plant, this tank is, I want it to be kind of heavily planted, you know what I mean, with low, low tech plants, those slow growing plants. So if you guys give me advice on that, all advice is welcome. And I want to thank y'all for watching this video, Mr. Ellis, Glass City Cichlids, and I am out.